Hey guys, Chance here with Complete Trailers. Today we're gonna take a look at a trailer with more items on its spec sheet than you could imagine. I'm titling this thing Racetrack Junkies Dream because that's exactly what it is. This trailer is for the guy who's at the track all the time. Before we get started though, like, share, subscribe to the video, hit the little notification bell so you can see when we're posting our new videos. Follow us on social media as well to get an idea of what we're doing day to day. First and foremost on this trailer, let's talk about the size the trailer actually is. You know, it's eight and a half wide, like all race car trailers, 34 foot long, and that's from tip of the bunk to the very rear of the trailer. You know, eight foot on the bunk leaves you 26 on the floor. Now, of course, there's a bathroom in here, which we'll talk about later. So that also takes up from some floor space on this model, but uh, we'll get into that here a little bit later. This trailer is based off of the CH405 package. Now, as far as packages go with ATC, you know, that is what they would call, as of now, the highest package. You know, there's some exciting stuff coming that we'll talk about later on. But yeah, as of now, CH405 is the top of the line package with the options it comes right out of the box with. You know, you can see all of the fine aesthetics, which you've come to expect from ATC. The lighted spoiler, that's a CH405 exclusive. Uh, not that you can't get it on other trailers, but that is something that comes in the package, as well as the perimeter skirting. And, uh, you know, most of the stuff is on the inside, though, which we will see here in a little bit. We've got the awning, that's a 12 volt awning. You just hit one button and uh, you know out it goes as long as your batteries are turned on. And we've got a, a pretty extensive battery bank in this trailer to power all of the 12 volt things that are on this trailer. Let's take a look at the other side though. It's a lot happening over there. All right, so as you can see on this side of the trailer, there's a lot more going on as far as all these hatches, these doors, all the different things you can see here. I'm probably gonna go from closest to me out on, on these options. And the first thing you see there is, I'm sure you can't read it, but it's a fresh water connection. Now, you may not need that at the track, considering you're probably gonna be parked out in, in a more desolate area, there may not be water, but you know, as opposed to having your water tanks, which are on board, um, you, know, you have a city water connection. The big door, I mean, everyone knows what this is at this point, this is a premium escape door. Now, ATC has been doing their rendition of this premium escape door for a literal decade. You know, that's, that's longer than a lot of these companies who are kind of duplicating what our trailer looks like have been around. You know, they haven't been in business as long as we've been doing just this door. Um, and you'll see comparisons between other trailers, not gonna say what they are, but they are essentially comparing the trailer to ATC. And as you can see, the great thing about this trailer is it really shows a scope of what can be done as far as quality and, and just the options, you know? There's no other trailer company that's gonna have a fit and finish with this much going on as ATC. So, but yeah, that's the premium escape door there. You can see there's a diesel fill tank, and uh, that's because we've got a 10K Onan diesel generator on board of this trailer. I mean, that's a, that's a powerful unit. That could probably power two of these trailers, uh, but we've got a lot going on, and the specific customer who bought this trailer wanted to be able to power everything and never have to work. And so that's why we did the oversized generator. It's a great option. Um, you've got those doors there. Now those are fuel stations and, and there's a separate fuel tank for that because obviously that's for a gas car. And when you're at the track, you don't want to carry gas cans. You pull that car up beside your trailer and fill it up. It's a great option. It's just, this trailer is just from top to bottom meant to be easy, you know, for, for the guy at the track. All right, guys, we've kind of looked at both sides of the trailer here. So let me open this up here and show you, uh, you know, our, our ramp system here to load these really low profile race cars, you know, that this trailer's designed to haul. And one thing I did forget to mention when we were going through, I'm sure if you see the wire there, but that is a, a pre-wire for a backup camera if someone wanted to do that. So it's a cool option. Paddle latches here, which you've seen on many of our trailers. It's kind of the best, uh, best door latch option that we've been able to find here. Now what's nice is this is a, you know, with these ramps, you'd call it a pretty heavy door because it's such a such a nice aluminum product. You can see I'm, you know, lowering this with one hand, able to pick it up and close it with one hand. I mean, it's it's really nice and, and overly built, you know, for, for years of, uh, of use. You know, and that kind of goes with the whole trailer, right? This is an all aluminum frame trailer. So you're talking a big gooseneck with all these options. It comes in at 8,000 pounds, you know, a little over. You know, that's hard to beat. That, that's very uh, very towable now these ramps are secured here with a pretty simple system but uh once you get them out of there you know it's a quick little process
right away when we open this thing up, you can see the versatility this trailer has. You know, two, you know, rows of recessed E-Track, multiple swivel D-rings, and you can tie down virtually anything. You know, whether you're using an over-the-wheel tie-down strap, we like Max Custom tie downs. Those are great. I kind of give them a little shout out here, but they're one of the best over-the-wheel tie downs, and you know, regular traditional tie downs as well. They have that are awesome as as a, as a fine product to match a fine trailer like this. Uh, we've got full row of cabinets here. You can see there's also some puck lighting underneath here to help illuminate the inside of the trailer. Bright LED lights. Uh, this is one of the options that comes standard with the 405 package. You know, this is your spare tire compartment here. So you don't have to worry about having a clunky spare tire somewhere in the body of the trailer itself or in the back of your truck. And you just drop it in here. It's hidden, it's easily accessed. It's a great location for that. You're probably wondering what all these boxes are in here. Well, if you remember, we looked at all those different features on the outside, you know, your fuel station and uh, all of that. That does take up some space on the inside, but as you can see, it's not past the fender, so it doesn't intrude with the car at all. Here is that battery bank I also mentioned earlier. You know, these uh, batteries are in here to help power all your 12 volt, keep your generator firing up. You know, we've got three, you know, these AGM batteries. So they really, really help with uh, being able to power your lights and things like that. The more batteries, the better, really, if you think about it, because, you know, once one goes, you've got another one, another one. There's a trickle charge uh, from your vehicle. And it's not a lot, it's not a lot, but it is something, you know, if you're going on a long trip to the track. You know, that giant, the uh, owning commercial grade generator we looked at, its control panel is here inside the body of the trailer. So you don't really ever have to mess with that, uh, you know, that area too often. You know, it's fully ventilated, it's ready. You have seen where the fuel station's located. It's really intuitive, but you know, you can prime and start the generator here, monitor your fuel, all of that. Uh, the awning we mentioned is 12 volts. You've got controls from the inside. I would extend that for you, but it's a little windy today, so I won't be doing that. But uh, all your lights are here, and that's for your interior lights, your exterior lights, and these puck lights underneath the cabinets. From what I've heard, one of the worst situations being at the being at the racetrack is having to go to the bathroom. And depending on where you're parked and what the bathroom setup is, and maybe porta potties, it sounds like nobody really wants to use that. So here's your bathroom. Right, and so now you're probably gonna have all your buddies are gonna wanna come in here and borrow your bathroom. That's up to you. But uh, for this trailer, we've got a, a toilet, it's, its own waste system, and a sink. So, I mean, you don't have to worry about ever using a disgusting bathroom at a racetrack again. Here's a little control box for your bathroom. So you can see, you know, what your, what your wastewater, fresh water, and your tank levels are, as well as your battery. You know, it's, it's kind of a nice little control panel. This here is to control the Two air conditionings are on this trailer, and I, that leads me to another thing. On that CH405 package, right out of the bat, you get a fully insulated trailer. Uh, we did upgrade the insulation to another level above what the standard is in this trailer, just because you know it, it makes sense, especially if you're here in Texas, to have the air conditioning run all day. So the better insulation you have, the more efficient your air conditioning will run. This has two, like I mentioned. So the ladder here goes up to the observation deck. Uh, this has a reinforced roof so that you can stand up up there, sit up there, lounge up there, uh, just like your porch at home. You know, there's a railing system up there you set up for safety, and you can sit up there with the cold one and watch the races. Thanks for checking out the video, guys. As you can see by looking at this trailer, there are thousands of options available. I mean, any number of things can be done to your trailer. Uh, we'd be happy to help you. No one knows this stuff better than us. We, we have a great reputation in the industry, and we would be more than happy to help you guys get your trailer built out exactly how you want it. Remember, like, share, subscribe. Thanks again.